All right, gang, here with Mike from Mr. Guns and Gear channel. We're gonna talk about the Bravo Company Gunfighter 1911 built exclusively by Wilson Combat. Yep. And we're gonna share our impressions of shooting a well-fitted custom 1911 because it is noticeably different than shooting a standard out-of-the-box 1911. Yep. Would you not agree, Mike? Yeah, I would agree. I mean, just the way the recoil impulse is gonna be different because it's not as jagged, if you will. For those of you guys that have shot it, you'll know what I'm talking about, but for those that haven't, um, as that slide is coming back and going forward, it's doing so on a very smooth level plane, which is the rails that obviously are hand-fitted at Wilson Combat. So that's gonna make for a much smoother recoil impulse while you're firing the gun. It makes a big difference, especially if you ever get a chance to shoot a gun like this versus a box stock 1911, you'll notice it immediately. With the same ammo, the recoil impulse is much more linear. It's, and you hear people say this, gun writers have even talked about how it feels like the slides on ball bearings. Yep. All right, so first up, I'll do a build drill. Sounds good. Want to steal, and then we'll let you have at it. All right. All right. Can live with that. I'd say so. Good deal, brother. We'll get you up. All right. Six shots on steel. Let's see how we do. All right, no doubt about it. When you're actually firing that and you feel the recoil impulse, it's definitely smooth and it tracks back on target really well. Yeah, and you know, one thing that some people tend to overlook is, you know, a steel frame light rail 1911 does have a little bit more weight to it, so it is softens the recoil just a little bit more. Yep, it's gonna add a couple ounces right there on the front of the gun, so. Which is where it, where it helps. Yep. If you're looking to get one of these, it's gonna be available from Bravo Company. Yep. Right now, I think 100 is ordered. Is that correct? It's a limited edition? As far as I know, 100 as of right now. Okay, and it's right around three grand or just under. Yep. So it's not going to be cheap, but you get what you pay for. Now, make sure you take the time to subscribe to Mr. Guns and Gear channel as well as the Vickers Tactical YouTube and Full30.com channel. Have a good one. Hey, thanks for watching the Vickers Tactical YouTube channel. To subscribe, click here. And to watch some of my favorite videos, click here. Have a good one. LAV out.